If Christ is the center of your life, you'll always be focused on Him. Our Daily Bread Today's encouragement from the Our Daily Bread devotional was written by Jennifer Benson Schult. Best-selling author Chaim Potok began his novel The Chosen by describing a baseball game between two Jewish teams in New York City. Reuven Malter, the book's main character, notices that the opposing players' uniforms have a unique accessory. Four long, rope-like tassels that extend below each teammate's shirt. Reuven recognizes the tassels as a sign of strict obedience to God's Old Testament laws. The history of these fringes, known as tzitzit, began with a message from God. In Numbers 15.38, we know that through Moses, God told his people to create tassels containing some strands of blue thread and attach them to the four corners of their top garments. God said, you may look upon the tassels and remember all the commandments of the Lord and do them. God's memory device for the ancient Israelites has a parallel for us today. We can look at Christ, who consistently kept the whole law in our place and obeyed his heavenly Father. Romans 13 reminds us that having received his work on our behalf, we now put on the Lord Jesus Christ and make no provision for the flesh to fulfill its lusts. Keeping our eyes on God's Son helps us to honor our Heavenly Father. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Numbers chapter 15, verses 37 through 41. The Lord said to Moses, Speak to the Israelites and say to them, Throughout the generations to come, you are to make tassels on the corners of your garments, with a blue cord on each tassel. You will have these tassels to look at, and so you will remember all the commands of the Lord, that you may obey them and not prostitute yourselves by chasing after the lusts of your own hearts and eyes. Then you will remember to obey all my commands and be consecrated to your God. I am the Lord your God who brought you out of Egypt to be your God. I am the Lord your God. That's today's scripture reading from Numbers, chapter 15, verses 37 through 41. And now let's pray together. Dear Jesus, thank you for being our spiritual role model. Help us to walk in your steps so that we can honor and obey God with the Holy Spirit's help. It's in your name we pray. Amen. Today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries, 